Hey folks, welcome back with Graph Gaming. Uh, today we're going to be playing Fights in Tight Spacers. This is a deck building roguelike martial arts game. Uh, it's another one of those games that I played an actual crap ton when it first came out and then didn't touch anymore uh, for several years now. Also, it is 4 a.m. I'm tired and look like shit. And, uh,. I'm not a point with a camera. That's Cat. That's Cat. He's drinking water right now. Let's get into it. Um, we're gonna find Classic. Uh, I don't have a tutorial. We're just getting into it. H11, sir. We have a number of emerging situations that could do with your skills. Balanced. Uh, oh, yeah. Let's do the training. Because, well, I haven't played this game absolutely forever. Turn to base deck building roguelike. You would need a rotate screen. Highlight. Select. Spinning back fist. Range 2. Maintain it. Sure. Uh, here? Here? Oh, he's the enemy. Yes. Ciao! Some cards require momentum to play, which is over here in the corner. Uh, pop right of the card. Sure, got it. Momentum's shown here. Play the focus card to refill momentum. You can see the minimum max range of the attack. This one requires two, this one requires one. Got it. Cool. Now I'm close enough to get it. All right, I pretty much got it. I need to learn what the rotates do. You won your first fight. A fight ends when your opponent, every opponent is defeated, or when we completed all the main objectives. Enemy recon. During a mission, you'll come across a variety of enemies. You'll sometimes be given warning where and when new enemies will arrive. Look for this marker. If the tile is blocked at the end of the turn, the enemy will be prevented from arriving until the next turn. Got it. Alt to see the current health of all enemies. Enemies will be active if they are targeting the player at the beginning of their turn or if any character enters their range during their turn. Oh, okay. We're pushing him into this person's line of sight so then they activate. Once the enemy has been activated, they'll attack the in turn regardless of the allegiance of the target. Got it. So the order they attack, so he'll attack first, attack second. Fist icon means they're currently primed to attack on their turn. Got it. Bow! Enemies can move during their turn. Depending on their attack range, they move towards you or keep distance from you. Try to stay away from tiles adjacent to avoid and get out of the way of other enemies. Jab. Now front kick. Because we knock him out of the arena. Got it. Easy peasy. The fast tutorial too. Comprised of an alternate movement option amount. Option play card to close the end. Oh, I can move too. Okay, got it. Head smash can be used only when the target stays into a wall or a barrier. Got it. So now that he's facing me, he's going to be primed to attack. Understood. If I was pushed out of the fight, they are knocked over out immediately. You need to push over rallying hazards. Goodbye. Every time you make a successful attack, combo level increase. Combo is maintained between turns, but any movement you do will reduce your combo level by one brief tile of movement. You need to reposition in order to attack. Now that with very few exceptions, you can only move in a straight line on the board. You set to get closer to the highlight of Got it. 
Joel to increase my combat level. Left wing kick. So we took six damage from the kick and four from running into the wall. Got it. And then counter means we have next. Click the card first. Select an enemy and then the destination. Cool. So many counter mechanic helps go nice and easy. Finish the fight. Um who goes first? Alright, I'm gonna shift to the side of him and then yeah. Tell me vibe. Nice and easy. Now we go to the Deathhead Biker Gang. After the Biker Gang Wars of the 90s, we thought we'd seen the last of the Nordic Gangs, but they're back with a network of so-called clubhouses across Scandinavia. We're seeing a massive increase in smuggling operations on Northern European borders. Put a stop to it. Tatusha. <laughs> This one do have a good soundtrack too, which is nice compared to the other game that we're playing. Okay, what are we doing? Three momentum. Twelve, and then a kill. It's pretty nice. damage. I'll just push you away. Some cards have the ability to counterattack and some enemies have the same ability. Look for an icon. Sure. Got it. So they were just telling us we can do it. Which is fine. Four damage and push. Counter. Okay, we're just gonna... Chill. And knock his eyes down with the battery. I'm gonna move... Oh, no, 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 we're gonna ship. And then front kick him. Oh, but I killed him anyways. Man. Alright, we'll just that. Uh, we're gonna slip. We're gonna push. We're going to front kick him. And we're gonna head smash it out. Noise? What is show replay? Oh yeah, we're gonna see me beat them up in real time. Gain a new card. Slash seems nice. Two bleeding is an extra two damage. 
Actually, front kick's probably better than. It's for a style like move and push just seems really good. Um, hold on the bar. Void titles are places people die. It's fine. Enemies with auto attack attack you and anyone else the moment they step into the range. Sure. Um. Oh, collect the briefcase in six turns for some extra money. I don't want to do this. I kick you. And then I'm going to long strike you. The long punch. And then... Can I jump over that? I don't think so. We're going to here. Good kick. Yeah, stopping the view. Start kicking you in. And then vibing. Great job, buddy. Uh, that's nice. Injuries or undesired cars that could add to your deck? Sure, I don't have any. So I don't really care. Um, he's gonna do how much damage? Four? We're gonna add a counter. And then we're going to. Oh, what a bad spot. I am just gonna hammer this thing. And then five? Are in fact in a bad spot. But I think we can do this now. Front kick. We're gonna do a lot of incidental damage here, which is pretty sick. Push. And then we can kill him. And combo finisher advances, so I don't want to do that. Um, now we... Either side. Other side. There we go. Um, I really want to get a break gate briefcase in one turn. Might be a little tough, though. We have a dash and a dash, and that does not get us to the briefcase. Unfortunate. Ooh. We're closer, but we do not. We still do not get the briefcase. That's okay. We don't need the money. I don't even know what I can spend it on. Uh, front kick, get to the wall. Dash in, head smash. And we did it. I think left fin kick is the most interesting of the three. Let's go to the gym. Oh, okay, so this is where we spend money. Or we can upgrade. Shove seems like a good card. 
I like the ones that move enemies. And then upgrade also costs money. Fish. I don't know what these upgrades do. What do you do? Okay. Three more damage. Six more damage, absolutely. It's a lot more. And we'll move on. Motorbike bay. That's a cool looking enemy. Enemies with wide attacks attack 7,000 in front of them instead of just one tile. Got it. You are sick. Hello. Um. Man, I wish I had spin kick right now. Uh, I mean, like, I can get out of this. It's not really in a way I want to. Three times ten. I think just means 10 damage to all three spots, but we'll just dash back for now, I think. Oh, I should have I should have hit her before I left. That's okay. We're looking for something that gets me out of this. Okay, we can step. Dash. Am I better to emergency move here to the corner? No, that's probably wrong. Step, dash, quick strike, front kick kills, okay. Step, dash, punch, kill. And now we're in a much better spot here. Okay. Do this. I think this then activates the gun person. There we go. That's what we wanted. Um, let me just shift this way. Okay. of their current position. I think I just go back one, honestly. Okay. Now we can do more. Front kick here goes kind of crazy. Well, ooh, actually. I can't get to go inside, though. Alright, we'll start with free damage. You know, if I had done the kick on him, we could definitely have done enough damage to kill him with combo finisher. Alright, I think instead we're gonna take the...
He does eight. He does ten. I know who I'm taking damage from. Ow. Okay. Strike. Hammer fist. This is a rough thing to have. We should get him now, though. Yes. Separate? Push enemies one tile in opposite directions and deal eight damage. Nerve strike. That's neato. I like the quick strike though. I don't know how often no auto attack is gonna come up. Well, let's get separate. Let's diversify. It's, it's interesting. Um, and then let's go to the event. Lose 5 health, gain a free character upgrade? Absolutely. Um, free upgrade. Combo finisher goes crazy. Base 18? Absolutely. Uh, now I'm gonna go to medical, and we're gonna heal. The motorcycle club. Nice and easy. You're cool. Start with armor. Not be thrown on the floor. There's no block. Sure. I wish I had the one that takes me to the other side of the enemy, but that's okay. I guess we'll just kill him. Actually, if we get our combo high enough, it pushes him to the left. Never mind. Yeah, we'll just kill you with pushes. Actually, I can just kill him. I can. Nope, no, I cannot. I. Mm -mm, that uses one. <laughs> no, no. Stuck in a corner. Um, we're at 30 right now. I think we do it with hammer fist and then the combo. 32. Oh, we're close. I'm 
stupid and I don't have enough momentum. Whoops. That's a it's early. Why am I playing the game at 4 a.m.? Is I guess a question you might have had from the start. Um, I don't know. I got home from locals yesterday. Um, I ate dinner and I just like slept on my couch in <laughs> until like 5 a.m. It was a weird night. Or 4 a.m. Um, 12 block cannot be pushed. Quick block plus is great. Let's just get more damage. Let's bang out two events in the gym. <laughs> I'm just good at this game. You kind of mob doctor. Um, yeah, I'll increase my max health. And then heal. And then we go to the gym. Grapple. Ponder. I'd rather upgrade. Um, what's particularly good to upgrade? What does Hammerfist upgrade to? Just more damage plus two per combo is really good. Counter upgrade is sick. Step is nice. One pilot in any direction. Super step as well. Alright, last level. The pub. Boss. You know what this reminds me of? It's like, um... Super hot in the art style, I feel like. Anyways, the tracker movement will turn to face you when you move during their turn. Enemies summon abilities will periodically add new enemies to the fight. Sure. Hello. Biker boss. Got it. Um, thinking. We're just gonna kill you. Oh, I turned him to face me. Whoops. Don't mind me. Uh, okay. Very good at this game, as you can tell. Shut you down there. step away after and be like completely fine you can still hit me but they're gonna shoot each other which is pretty cool. oh they're actually just both gonna shoot him even better okay um heavy i And I didn't think about the fact that I could have just, uh, whatever. Uh, yeah, absolutely take less damage by three. Good work, Agent 11. You constructed a large part of the Death Head's infrastructure. It was nothing. What's next on the agenda? We'll take a look. What's next is the Insiders. And I think we'll take a look at that, uh, next episode. So, thank you folks for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more, uh, definitely give me a subscribe, a like if you're feeling generous. Uh, and I'm planning to at least try and finish this campaign in episodes. So, if you want to see more of these videos, definitely give me a subscribe. I've said that twice now. That feels like too much. Anyways, I hope you all have a great day.